Okay, hello everyone, how are you? Today is uh, January the 4th, Wednesday, and this is the recap of the webinar that we had last night with our CEO and other members of the team. So without further ado, let's get started. Uh, there was quite a big panel uh, of founders that were on there. They all gave their hellos and best wishes for uh, 2023 and then we saw our COO uh, Mohammed Kamal he came on uh, he gave us a few updates uh, they're currently in uh, Hyderabad uh, but they're actually heading back to Dubai now he said what an incredible 2022 we've had you've no idea he said what is coming so excited to hear that news uh, I think we've got some really special things in the pipeline coming up very very shortly and uh, obviously i'll give you more updates of that uh, what happened as well he said all the teams uh, are combined now as one unit this is uh, all the guys in hyderabad and also the people in uh, dubai one heart bringing all of what has been promised together for not only the founders but also the customers who will be using on passive he also introduced the uh, tech guys who have been working tirelessly, not only on O-Connect, but also on other um, projects as well within on Passive. And he wished us all a very, very happy new year and prosperous 2023. We then saw our CEO, Ash Mufara, and he said that they hoped uh, 2023 will be better than 2022. Not in uh, the bad way that you might expect. He said... The best years are coming. It's going to get better and better, he said. He is super, super fired up. This is the year to shine on, and he wished us a healthy 2023 and years beyond that as well. He said that 2022 has been an incredible year for On Passive, and I and the rest of the leaders have been talking about this over the last uh, week or so of how far we have come in 2022. So much more now to come for 2023. Things really are looking very, very good. We've enjoyed the uh, journey, and but from now on, uh, it's only going to get better. He also said that he felt like the founders have become part of his family, which is fantastic uh, to see. We then saw uh, our uh, head of the media department, Dr. Sahar, came on and she gave us some pretty cool update she welcomed everybody into 2023 and she said we've all had an amazing festive season he said she thanked all the brand ambassadors for the kind birthday wishes that she had and she feels very very welcomed into the on passive family she shared a wonderful birthday celebration video given to her and she also said we are now at the moment looking for growth within uh, on on passive that impact building skills and reevaluating always to keep moving forward. This is what we are trying to do. She also thanks uh, Nassal and the team for all the video content uh, for the long and short videos. And I think we all agree that the shorts that are coming out at the moment on a daily basis, one, two, three, even four, every single day on social media are being produced by On Passive. Fantastic stuff. She also then mentioned a little bit about the FIFA World Cup. Uh, the viewership uh, has been the best ever for World Cup. And that tells us we've had uh, massive viewers, uh, not only for the World Cup, also for on Plassive. And this is going to reflect on all platforms. Uh, she said that the New Year theme on the new website is now up. And I spoke about this the other day. Again, thanks to Nazelle and the marketing team for putting this in place and she said by the end of today the laser video of that uh, advert we had on the Burj Khalifa earlier on that's going to be up on the official on passive YouTube channel if you haven't already subscribed to that guys go over there subscribe to it and then you'll get all of the notifications that come up as far as on passive is concerned uh, she also then shared a video presentation of Christmas celebrations in Hyderabad and also the December story that had been done by Dr. Susan uh, for the whole of December. Uh, she also then did a video presentation by the marketing team that wrapped up 2022. An amazing number of hours data and global recognition was accumulated. Thousands upon thousands of hours have been spent 
and accumulating this data. She then said, whatever 2023 has in store, we will all be in it together. We are going to win. Uh, she said all videos that are available on the YouTube, uh, you can share them and you can view them. That is not a problem. We then heard back from our CEO, Ashmu Farah, and he gave thanks to the teams behind all the videos that have been produced. And she said, he said, I see everything ahead to set more records. He said, I hope it will be a better year for you, but not the best. This is really to do with we have come so far, but there is so much more that we are going to do as far as on passive is concerned. The first on passive laser advertisement of 2023 kicked off earlier on uh, on the Burj Khalifa, and this was held at 9 p.m. Dubai time. Uh, there was a few restrictions, he said, but we went ahead with it anyway. Uh, with what we were allowed uh, to do. And all credit goes to the media and digital marketing teams uh, for that. He said there's going to be a whole new different show uh, to, is going to be created and this is going to be held on the 7th of January uh, and where we'll be able to view it. There's also going to be another founders webinar coming this week, probably Saturday, but obviously we will get more details on this. But one thing he did say is, there is going to be a massive bomb dropped uh, at this next web webinar, which is probably Saturday. It's going to be a new milestone. And he said, if you remember back to March of last year, this is going to be a whole new top. Uh, very disruptive in a good way. And maybe uh, the company, uh, uh, maybe the only company to ever achieve what uh, this bomb is going to be dropped on us on Saturday. So the ecosystem had a big uh, spike in the migrations. He said we're now around about 90% of the foundership that have migrated across. And now we are looking at stabilizing this. Many thanks to all of the leaders who have helped many of the founders to migrate from the old O founders uh, site to, o to their new ecosystem. He said it's very likely that we're going to uh, put a clock on the first years as far as what we have already paid for, that $97 for that registration fee. He said uh, you've not yet consumed any of the balance of that money for the first year, regardless of how long you've been in, whether it's one year, one uh, or four years. He said it, the clock has not stopped, uh, started yet. So he said uh, the refund is still available at the moment, but obviously uh, that is going to come to an end very shortly and we will get details on that. Uh, there will be many exclusive events and the founder members have front row status as far as these is concerned. This is a thank you for helping the company to get to this point. And we have said this as leaders many, many times to you guys, the founders, that we have been an integral part as founders to help found this business. And this is really the reward that we are now getting from the company for where we have been there with, it, with them all of this journey. And this is just a little thank you from the company. He said a renewal of that position uh, may not be available uh, to everybody, but the status of founder will be well recognized by many who are deserving of this recognition. This is all still to be evaluated and what the criteria is as far as that is going to be going forward. He said a discussion and presentation of why people give up. Uh, he shared this on a screen share. He said, remember where focus flows, energy goes. And the best way to achieve is to use the on passive tools to help those uh, to reach the success levels that they want. But each each person must climb this hill by themselves. Yes, that we will give you the tools. Yes, we will give you the help. But if you want to achieve it, you have to climb it yourself. We are here to help, but you actually need to take those first steps. Uh, he said, just use the platform uh, such as, uh, as migrated as you did, attend the webinars, keep up to speed, and you will be in the driving seat as far as your lives are concerned. The decision is yours, he said, and only yours. He gave an illustration of A, B, C, D. He's, uh, sorry, B, C, D. What is that? Birth, choice and death. B and D are given, but C is definitely up to you. That choice, he said, only you 
can make that choice. Nobody can give it to you. We can show you, but you have to make it. So he said need uh, needed to be sure that you are what you are doing in order for others to follow. You have two choices. You have excuses or result, results, but the choice is yours. Dream big, he said, and if it's not possible in on passive, then it is not uh, possible anywhere else because of the vision and ethics of the business platform of on passive people really are going to be measured by the scope of their dreams on passive keeps inventing new tops because we are winners we will never ever quit he then mentioned about o connect and he said that o connect was an incredible event very successful step he said now we want to keep on moving forward with it. We are able to feel it, to experience. He said this is going to be a revolutionary webinar platform in the Internet. We are sailing into uncharted and unknown waters, but we are navigating our way through it with the help of AI technology. He said choose to win with on passive. But that choice has to be now. On Passive has a massive vision. We want you to be with us. And what we have already achieved is huge. It's not been easy. It's been extremely hard to fight these battles. But remember, the sweeter the victory, the harder the battle, the sweeter the victory. We've got the budget. We've got the resources. We've got the expertise. And we certainly have the foundership and the will and determination to make this possible, regardless of the rough roads ahead. We will achieve our end results. So many moving parts have gone into this at the moment, but there has been a lot of negative forces against us. But on passive will prevail. We then heard from Dr. Sahar again, and she showed us the video presentation of the Burj Khalifa. A huge amount of views. She said, just look at the amount of people that are taking pictures of what we saw then. Again, she thanked the marketing and design teams. And the uh, founders are very appreciative and we couldn't have done it without us, she said. We once again heard back from our CEO. He then said, choose whatever outcomes you want for the end of this year. You have to choose it right now. On Passive is just the vehicle to help you to achieve these goals. You see, it's like DNA, he said. He says it's within you, but you have to make that choice. Make the decision. To this year, 2023, is your is his year, he said. It is why he was personally born for what is coming in 2023, as far as on passive is concerned. Progress over many sectors will be achieved in this year. Education, human resources, marketing, communications, and a lot, lot more. O-Connect, he said, will not be okay. He said, I'm sorry to say this. It's not just going to be OK. It is going to be the most addictive webinar platform available. You will feel the passion, the userness, the friendliness. All of this is original, but it's done with love behind it all. Uh, we saw what we saw with O Connect. It is going to be so, so cool. He then finished off by saying on passive will take you to the top if you choose to. And then another top and another top. Just be in it mentally. It is going to impact so many people. But he said this year's path is going to be decided by you. That's it from me for this uh, recap. I hope it's been of help for you and I will speak to you all very, very